Okay, so there's a few things we need to do. And um, I don't know what time of the day. Oh, you know what? We're going to put this clock to use. I don't want to start something if I know that we're going to have to go to sleep in a minute. But at the same time, I don't know what the time is. So, okay, I'm pretty sure that's midday. So here's what I want to do. There's so many ideas that I've got and I want to keep track of all these ideas. Look at all those water waves. That's so cool. I want to tra keep track of all these ideas. I'm going to make like a little tasks list, which I'll need a lectern and all that sort of stuff. So let's do that, uh, which means we're going to need ink. We're going to need feathers. Do we have any feathers? We should have some feathers. Ah, there we go. Yeah, squeedy, squeedy, squeedy. Oh, there we go. Hey yeah, come here, squid. Thank you, appreciate it. I think that's enough. So what we can now do is make a book and quill, a lectern, and then that that way, what we'll do is we'll have like an item sort of planner, and we can put everything in Minecraft because I've got so many new ideas. And one of those ideas is I want to make the world's deepest swimming pool. That's going to be so cool. So let's um. Let's go get all our stuff that we need. We'll just chuck this down here for now. As I keep saying, we're gonna sort all this out, but okay. So let's write in our lectern. These are the things we wanna do. Tree of life as per YouTube comment, which we'll go back to and obviously we'll shout that person out. Big sword, world's deepest pull. So that'll be that for now. We'll chuck this bad boy on here. And now as we need to add to it, we can. So, so far those are it. If you've got any project ideas, let me know. and We'll chuck them in, in our list and it should be sleep time soon. And there's something else I wanna do. I wanna use end rods for lights from now on. So we're not gonna farm these anymore. Um, I've got me an idea. All right, sheepy, let's go. I'm gonna shear them first and then I'll make them our kids. So there we go. Oh, so much sheep. Fantastic. Oh my god, we've already got a stack. This is chaotic, guys. This is so chaotic. Oh man, we got like three stacks. We're gonna have enough wool in no time. Come on, make babies. And the amount of EXP we're getting as well. Uh, I guess we'll just shear these guys then. Okay, I think that'll do for now. Man, we got like almost four stacks. That's so cool. This is so chaotic. This is so wildly chaotic. These horses are like, what the hell's going on over here? <laughs> there we go. All right, sheepy, let me out. Let me out. Oh my God, this is annoying. This cat, move, sheep. You know how much meat we're gonna have once we're finished with these sheep? Okay, so I'm thinking if we make the world's biggest pull, because there's a lot of other things I wanna do. I wanna make pathways in that, particularly a pathway going to our big monument, because inside might be like a observation deck or something. And then if we're gonna make a pathway out here or something, I'm thinking we can make a pull, the world's deepest pull out here as well. That'd be cool. I think we might make it like somewhere here. Okay, how wide should we make it? Might make it seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I think that might be ideal. So this will be the outside wall or where the glass is gonna be out here. And then this is gonna be water. And we're also gonna need a bunch of shovels and pickaxes too. So let's get all that, let's get food. And I thought of another idea for, um, for our little projects book as well, the dropper. So the drop is gonna be coming as well. If you're an OG, you'll know exactly what that is. So we're gonna need a ton of pickaxes. Let's get our cobblestone. <laughs> All right, this is gonna be fun. Let the digging begin. I think what we might do is we might just dig the perimeter just in case for whatever reason. And I've definitely underestimated how much, uh, how many pickaxes we need as well. We're gonna need a lot more than that. Luckily, we're only doing the perimeter for now though, because if we had to do the whole thing, we would have run out of pickaxe like way up there. And I feel like we're also dodging all the caves. <laughs> Imagine if we dig down and there's like zero caves. I reckon after this next row, there's gonna be a cave. That's my guess. It'd be cool if I'm actually right. So it was supposed to be after this row and it looks like I'm wrong. Oh, okay. I was right. Yeah. Oh God. Can we smother him? We can. We can, we can, we can. There we go. We big brained it. Look at us go. Oh man. Okay. Um, 
All right, all right, what are we doing? Okay, we need more of this sand. Okay, I think we're fine now. Ooh! So we'll make like a little spiral staircase and get some more supplies. I mean, this has got to be all dug out anyway, so it's not too bad. Now, I thought of a really good idea. You're probably thinking, how are you going to use this world's deepest pool if you're not, being, you're not going to be able to hold your breath? Well, at first, I thought the novelty was you can't unless you use like the turtle scoot helmet or whatever it is that gives you extra breath, even which I don't think that gives you enough. But then I thought I might even have like little diving checkpoints where I'll put like doors or something where like every so often you can stop to breathe. I think that'll be a cool idea. Either way, I'm going to do something. I reckon that would be so awesome. Well, we have to go up and get some pickaxes as well. So ooh, that's going to be fun. I kind of hope we've got enough um, scaffold though. We might be lucky. Just build it all the way up, I suppose. Sweet, plenty. We've got scaffold for days. Oh yeah, <laughs> we had plenty. Now look at that drop. That's crazy. I mean, we're getting some decent loot here as far as flint and coal and all that are concerned. Break this down, let it rain. <laughs> That's so cool. I love that. It's so fun, but I think a few of them might be stuck up at ground level, but whatevs. So all on the edge here is going to be um, basically some sort of building block, probably the deep slate tiles again. And then where it's like a cave system, I'm going to put glass blocks. So like you get this cool view when as you're going down. My thing is, how are we not hungry yet? Like we haven't eaten in ages and we've still got like a full hunger bar. That's weird. That's actually really odd. Oh my god, about time I've hit deep slate. It's been a long time coming, how deep? Oh my gosh, we are like almost at the center of the earth. I don't know, I love doing all these big grand projects. It's always so fun. Yeah, let us know what, what type of project you want to see me build in this Let's Play. Oh god, okay. All right. Oh, I've got an idea on how to make a wall. This actually looks like a big cave. So let's just chuck these bad boys down here. I think this is like a massive cave, guys. We are definitely not going to have enough um, material, by the way. Oh, well, this is a good cave. Sweet. Oh, that's not going to work. Because I was thinking if we keep building down, but we can't. We're going to need to get more stuff. Let's, let's climb up. How are we still not hungry? That's so odd. Make this make sense. We're not hungry after all that digging. Something is not right. I don't understand how we're still not hungry. Let's actually get some more sheep wool as well. All right, sheep, I'll come and feed and breed you guys. That's so much sheep. That's more sheep than you can point a stick at. <laughs> this is so fun. Kind of makes me feel a bit dizzy though, but and we still need to sort out all our items. I've been saying that since the dawn of time, but I never get around to doing it. All right, I'm curious to know. I reckon we're going to have like five blocks in one. Man, that's so many. I reckon five stacks. Yeah, it's crazy how much wool we're getting though. Okay, I'm sure there's still some wool blocks like that lying around. There's no way. We got like five stacks. That makes me so happy. All right, I'm guessing in this case, we're going to have like seven stacks, which is going to be insane. Let us know what your guess. Actually, pause the video right now. Take a guess. My guess is seven stacks. If we have more than seven, I'm going to lose my... <laughs> All right, let's see. How, oh, how many did I guess? Did I guess seven? Yeah, I guessed seven. One, two, three, four, five, six. Close. Thanks, sheep. I appreciate you. All right, let's breed them. I'm actually really happy because it means this sword's going to get done sooner than I think. You guys are all participating. Without your help, we wouldn't have this statue. So thank you, everyone. Ooh, it's EXP. I think we've made good life decisions, guys. Now, there is a good chance we're going to die when we go down here. So what I'm going to do is, obviously, I'm going to set the spawn point. Okay, which one's the pillar? Uh, yeah, this one's the pillar. And we've still got our scaffold. We do. Sweet. Oh, no! <laughs> ah! Oh, that is so disgustingly annoying. Why do I keep doing this? 
I hope we don't do the same thing. I mean, I feel like we're gonna get all our stuff anyway. It's all gonna be at the bottom, which is not bad. So I guess it could have been worse, but still. It could have been worse. I mean, we did lose a lot of- Oh God. Oh no. Man, what's wrong with me? I've got to be careful. I'm pretty sure this is the opposite side of the opening, I hope. Otherwise, everything's going to be dropped down there. I think all our stuff is down here. We just lose a lot of our EXP, that's all, which is not ideal, but... Oh, did anything drop down there? Nope. Okay, could have been... Well, actually, it is pretty bad because we lost a ton of EXP, but whatever. Okay, this is going to be... This is going to be chaos. Actually, this might even be impossible. Oh, there's diamond. Good to know. So, marker number one. Marker number two. Grab this guy because it's going to have to go anyway. Marker number three. How did I not die? I have no idea. No, get lost. No, nah. no, nah, I'm a goner, I'm a goner, I'm a goner, I'm a goner. I don't know how I did not die just then. I... Oh, no, no. Yeah. Buddy, this is not going to end well for you. I'm sick of you. Good. This is a lot more difficult than I thought it would be, guys. I am going to kill you, skeleton. I am going to kill you so badly right now. I'm glad that that's there because that'll make the not spawning happen. I know that doesn't make sense, but I don't care at this point. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so... Oh no, this is where we want the wall to be. Wait, hold up. I'm confusion right now. I think we've royally screwed this. I think we might have screwed this up like big time. I guess even if we did screw it up, we've got a little safe space to make our corrections. All right, where's our other markers? Yeah, so it's out that way, which is annoying, but whatever. All right. You know what? Let's go back up. Let's sort ourselves up properly because we are not doing this properly right now. All right, guys. Well, that was an ordeal. Look at all those sheep, though. It's crazy. We almost died of fall damage from that. How ridiculous. Let's go and eat some food. I mean, we've lost a lot of loot, which is not ideal, but... Man, look at that. Look at that list of everything that went wrong. <laughs> Anyway, guys, I think I'm going to leave it at that. That's been... Oh, I'm accidentally throwing you bread. Uh, <laughs> um, that was insane. I think... Oh, man, we should have planned ourselves better. That cave was killing me. Uh, but anyway, we've achieved a lot in this episode. I've been recording for a long time. So I'm going to leave it at that. We're going to continue this build. Hopefully, we get it done pretty soon. Hopefully, that was the last cave as well. But uh, yeah, anyway, let us know what you want to see in this Let's Play series as well. But guys, I'll catch you in the next video. And until next time, be awesome.